Hey everyone, welcome back. Here we are in uh, Subnautica, and we've been trying to find the engine fragments. And I think I have a better idea than hunting for the Cyclops. I think I'm going to go and peruse near the... Aurora crash site and try to sneak into the Aurora so that way I can get all the blueprints immediately. I, I think that's a thing where like if you um, go to the Aurora and fix it, you uh, you get all the blueprints downloaded to your um, to your uh, PDA. So I'm just gonna go take that route instead. You know, the the easier route. Because not only have I not found the scanner room fragments, but I can't seem to find anything that relates to the Cyclops. Now that I've already got the hole and the bridge. So, we're going to wander towards... Oh, we were already at basically near the... Okay, I went the wrong way. Okay, I should have uh, should have known that, but we're going to... We're going to head towards the other uh, crash site and get up close to it sneakily though because we don't want to uh get in the way of any reapers and then we're going to try to sneak aboard it and maybe just maybe get lucky We're gonna get real close. Real close. Yeah, we're real close right now. In radioactive environments. Wow, this area is pretty much dead. That's interesting. So. Isn't there a life pod nearby that's capsized I think there is like it's upside down and it's just like free hanging so maybe we'll get lucky and be able to oh it's right there That's deep. That's the seabed, apparently. Down there. Let's see what we got. First aid kit. Data box. And a PDA. Oh, this is one that gives you the creature decoy stuff. Perfect. I'm a little curious as to what's down here. Oh, this is the, um, okay. So we're just down, back down into one of these little areas here. All right. I, uh, I wonder if this is the one that I just came from. Or if this is a different one entirely. Let's listen. What was that? Yep, there it is. So this is the one that we were at earlier. Because we can hear the reaper call. So, thankfully because we're in a sea moth, That kind of spooked me a little bit. Let's see, how close are we to the, uh... Kind of close. Part of 
Part of me wonders if we can sneak through. Ooh, there he is over there. Let's be careful here not to not to make him mad. There we go. Oops. Oh, apparently that's a bounding box. Okay. So there's no way to get up from here. I want to try to avoid... any spots that open me up to being a target by the Reaper. Oh, we're close. Right here. I'm not in the mood to play these games, little buddy. Not at all. <sighs> Who's next? Go to the fire extinguisher. I'm gonna need that. Okay. I do not. Ah, great. I should have plenty of food at, um, available to me as I explore the Aurora, though. So. Perfect. Just what I need a battery. flashlight now. Alright, so... That's not available for me to take a look at, so I gotta be a little, uh, a little more careful in this area. Don't want to get electrocuted or anything. Let's see what we got here. Passcode. And a laser cut hole. So let's see what's in the PDA. Data downloads. Codes and clues. Lab access is 6483. Six, four, eight, three. <sighs> All right, perfect. We're in the lab. And I'll be taking that. And I'll be downloading that. Cool. More blueprints, I guess. Ooh, 
Was that all of them or was that just uh, some of them? I'm going to quickly resurface here and take a look. Um, okay, so we got the repulsion cannon, apparently. Um, although we're, that was just for that. So we're still missing quite a bit of stuff, but, you know, some progress. Maybe if we're lucky there's food in here. That'd be nice. Um. Hmm. Doesn't appear so. And I just realized that I just unlocked the lab access when there was literally no point of doing that. <sighs> See, last time I did this, I actually took the Cyclops into that little bay area after uh, completely getting smashed by the, um, the guarding reaper. So, where's the black box? Um, there we go, right there. Anything over here? Nope. Except the sea moth is pretty close, I guess. Oh, this actually leads us into the, um, the prawn suit bay. If I remember correctly. Yep, there they are, the prawn suits. Cool. That's what I'm talking about. So let's get the scanner. Where is the scanner? There's the scanner. I got time. I got time. Okay. Um. Let's see. I know there's food in the living quarters, so I'm gonna quickly sprint to there. Shoot, I might actually starve before I even get close. God, that would suck. Um, let's see, there should be one more prawn suit in here. There we go, right there. I really should have eaten something before I ran into here. Living quarters, perfect. Okay, there's gotta be some food in here. Right, there's gotta be something. Supply, perfect. Uh, filtered water, filtered water. Nutrition block, that's what I'm looking for. All right, filtered water. Okay, did I unlock the entirety of the prawn suit or just a majority of it? Let's find out. Nope, I got all of it. How is aerogel crafted? I don't think I have access to that recipe yet. Great. And I still don't have the modification station nor the scanner room. Ugh. Let's see if there's anything else that I may have missed here that I can pick up and run away with. I don't need that anymore, but I definitely need this. Oh. Okay. Hmm. 
Okay, so doesn't seem like there's uh, anything fun in here for me to mess around with. Um, ooh, what's in here? Another first aid kit. Um, lots of beds, which means lots of death, which is kind of sad. Uh, looks like that's someone's. Looks like that's someone's gal right there. Carry all. Hmm. Cabin one. Let's see, captain's quarters and cabin two. Okay, so I think we gotta do a little bit of hunting and maybe we have a uh, codes and clues. Nope. Hmm. Is there a PDA that we maybe missed? That took a long time to scan. Wow. Um, okay, so I can't repair any of those. That kind of sucks. Um, hmm. There's got to be some diary entries somewhere here. Maybe they're in a different hallway. Because there's like cabin seven and, oh, right there. Relationship contract and legal recording. Okay, I don't think that's what I'm looking for, but all right. Um, PDA. A battery. Disinfected water. Um, but still no sign of a PDA that has what I need on it. Okay, what's down here? I think this is where we came from. Yep, this is where we came from. Lots of fire. So there's the, another piece of the prawn suit there. But part of me really wonders uh, if I'm even going to even find some Cyclops fragments near here at all. <sighs> Great, that's empty. Um, no sign of a PDA in here either. Hmm. Did I maybe pick it up? Well, uh. Hmm. Um. No signs of other PDAs that I can pick up. Oh, there's a battery, though. I'll take that. Uh, I may as well scan some of the stuff in here. right down there. I think there is. Let's go and uh, see if that's available to me. <sighs> oh, we already have all the uh, black box signature. That's not really a problem. Um...
so it looks like that only eight of the actual life pods managed to make it there. Hmm. Interesting. Um, I don't... Maybe there's another way in and out of this area that I wasn't quite aware of. I know there's the one that's um, from where we just came from, but I'm wondering if there's maybe another one that I didn't know about. So, let's see. This isn't exactly as relaxing as I was hoping it would be, considering that we're basically exploring a falling apart ship. But this has to be done eventually, so... Um, is there anything in here that I can scan that, um, isn't going to leave me with disappointment? Anything? Anything at all? Okay, what's weird is that it insists that I can't, that, like, the way it's set up, it's like, it's almost like, um, you're supposed to come from this way. So, I'm trying to remember everything here. Oh, you've got to be kidding me. Really? All of these things are things that I can scan? <sighs> okay. So... Can't get in there, can't get in there. We've gone this way before to no avail. Same thing over here, no avail. Um, nothing behind there. This is just a locker kind of living quarters. Cabin one is locked. Cabin three is non-responsive. Cabin two as well. Maybe there is, um, oh, that's kind of interesting. Okay. So we're in this area here. We don't have another fire extinguisher. There aren't a lot of paths for us to take. It's almost as if there's something that's hiding from us. Um, did I miss a PDA by any chance? Let's um, clear out some of the inventory here and actually do some stuff, I guess with uh, all the stuff we're carrying around. Um, there's got to be something I'm missing, right? Is there a third area in here that I'm not aware about? If we're getting in and out. Let's see, no door over there. Lots of fire though. Um, hmm. No easy way to get in there. I think it wants me to like, try to come in through a different way or something. So, I might have to do that. Okay, power cell. I don't know why I need that, but okay, thank you. I mean, I'm going to need it eventually, but, you know. Um, where did I even come from in the first place? Like... 
there's all these like back going pipes and whatnot. It's just kind of hard to figure out where one actually comes from. Oh, here we go. So we've got this area here. Is there another spot to peek up from? Nope, there is not. Ah, how fun. Um, well, maybe I can, um, head in through a different air, like, you know, a different way, and, uh, get access to what I need through a different door. So now there's two ways in, so there's this way that I broke my way through, and then there's the one that you have to take the ramp to get to. So, to the ramp we go. Ugh, great. <sighs> are we really going to be doing this right now? Ah, uh, we are. Okay, who's next? Let's see. You, I see you up there. Don't try to run away from me. You can go to the moon. 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 You too. Who's next? <sighs> um, I cannot explain how awesome and fun it is just to grab these things and just launch them into the upper atmosphere with uh, the blink of uh, the, the snap of my fingers. It's incredibly fun. Okay. That fire extinguisher is much more important. Um, I guess there's no, really no point in me wasting it on these little fires here. I mean... All things considered. We already have the black box data. Kind of looks like a... Nah, it wasn't. is the Aurora. Is that a battery? I'll be taking that. Hope we need it later. Um, let's see. Codes and clues. Knows to self. There's a cargo bay code right there. Uh, Credits Altair is paying me. <sighs> um. All right. Well,
That'll do. Uh, I want to take what's ever in here, which I can't because the inventory's full. So, um, hmm. Okay. This is where the cargo bay code comes in. One, four, five, four. One, four, five, four. So this should open the door that we were trying to get to earlier. Nope, never mind. This is a very different area. So disinfected water, disinfected water, lots of water. Ooh, PDA. Uh, uh, let's see. There's anything this way here that might come in handy. Nope. Doesn't look like it. <sighs> Ouch. Okay, well, let's jump down, I guess. Nutrient block, inventory full. Well, allow me to drink some water so I can fit the nutrient block in my inventory. Um, I don't think I'll ever need to go to the Seamoth Bay, but let's, um, repair this entryway and see if there's, uh, anything useful in here. I'm pretty sure the Seamoth Bay was blown off, though. That was the Seamoth Hangar area. VR suit log. Oh, this is a VR system. That's kind of cool. Um, so, not a lot of... Um, okay. So, the drive room is up there, which is where we're going to be spending a lot of our time pretty soon. Now we have the prawn bay and the locker room, which is exactly where we want to go. There we go. Oh, hey, PDA. Um, let's see what we got here. I'm getting a really weird vibe from this area. Um, even though I know for a fact that the vibe I'm getting is actually from Prey and not this, I'm still getting a weird vibe. <sighs> okay, so all the links have been established now and we kind of went in full circle there, but we had to. Um, alright, so now we have, okay, 1869. Hopefully y'all didn't read that too in depth because there was a swear word in there, so. I, I don't know how y'all feel about uh, cursing and whatnot, but. Just 
just, uh, yeah, probably should have, um, I don't know. You said cabin one, right? 1869. Uh, okay. Um, nothing really... Oh, hey, look, it's an arcade jo uh, George toy. See, it's not George, it's Gorge or whatever. Gorg. I kept thinking it was George because I was afraid that I was, like, you know, showing my dyslexia. And then, nope, turns out I'm just an idiot. Just all around. <sighs> um... Although what I can say is those having minor dyslexia does lead to some pretty fun, um, some pretty fun, uh, situations. <sighs> hmm. Interesting. The random digits I put in did not open the door. Huh, okay. <sighs> okay, nothing too interesting in that, just, you know basically Minecraft gone wrong by the looks of it. Um, okay, this is kind of like a little annoying because I want to get in the captain's room here, but there's no easy way to get access. So... <sighs> a little tired I am. Um... Where's my phone at? I have no idea what time it is. Ah, yes, it is late. As usual. I think I'm stuck. Oh, no, I'm good. So, for those of you who are um, still watching right now, just wanted to give you a thank you. Or if you're asleep, you know, thank you. I don't know how that's going to help, but, you know, still. I mean, I know that, uh, that my videos aren't exactly used for sleeping among a lot of you. And it's more of something that's relaxing to listen to while, uh, while well, doing other things, but, um, you know, even if so, thank you for, uh, taking time to watch my stuff, because my stuff is, um, uh, interesting, to say the least. Well, I mean, it's not even really interesting, to be honest. It's kind of just weird. Okay, we don't want to go that way. We want to go this way. The drive room. Okay, here we go. This is where things get fun. <sighs> so, we just gotta repair all these little holes here. So we got a lot of them to do. Apparently. So. Let's see. Let's follow the sparks. There's one. Um. There's another one right there. Hmm. 
another one right here. Two over here. And uh, now we got a couple more. I know. Oh. Hey, back off, buddy. Okay. Um. Can you not? Don't make me pull the propulsion cannon out. I will pull that propulsion cannon out and I will end all of you with very, 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 very painful blasts into the walls of this containment area. Just trust me, that is the last thing you want. <sighs> Don't you dare. Okay, that's it. Nope, nope, nope. You get back here. Where'd you go? Hi. Bye. Hi. Bye. Anyone else? That's what I thought. Okay. We should have a, like, like one more left, I think. That was weird. The audio kind of got a little interesting there. Did I get all of them? Seems like I got all of them. Unless I'm just missing one of them. Is there any um, that are on the surface that I need to go and do? What's over here? Nothing fun. There's got to be one more, right? That I'm just missing. Where did I get all of them? Oh, there it is, right there. There you are. You're not the repair tool, you're the laser cutter. There we go. Cool. Cyclops engine efficiency module. Can I scan that? I will gladly take that. Darn it. Oh. Hold on. There we go. Thank you. Was there one over here too? I think that I just got the, um, okay, so now, um, <sighs> okay. Wow, 
Wow, I'm kind of tired. That's kind of good though, because that means I'll get a good night's sleep. I don't know if that was all of them or not, but I need to go and get a... Actually, shoot, was it all of them? Yeah, because he said radiation levels stabilizing. This will be the screenshot. Whoa. Oops, I didn't mean to do that. There we go. Maybe, maybe not. It's not very vibrant, so it's like not like a good screenshot to do. But I mean, I may as well, right? <sighs> well, anyways, thanks for watching. Sorry, these the past two episodes haven't been very good. Um, they're both being right recorded the same night. <sighs> I'm tired. I've been working on some stuff and trying to get some stuff out. And um, that's kind of led to me losing quality in video. So I'm sorry about that. But anyways, thank you for watching and have a fantastic night.